Hey guys, Level Cap here. Today we're going to be taking a look at a game called Squad Special Quilt Utilization and Allocation Division. Just kidding, there is no acronym for this game. It's just called Squad, and it's basically a spiritual successor or just a successor to the Project Reality mod for Battlefield 2. And I think it was also a mod for Arma 2. This game runs on the Unreal 4 engine and they are going for a very visually realistic look to the game. The setting is clearly somewhere in the Middle East and coupled with an engine that is supporting incredibly long view distance, the game can look hauntingly real at times. And the combat is also supposed to be incredibly realistic with realistic damage drop off and engagement ranges. The maps are incredibly large and go for kilometers in every single direction. I literally haven't even run into a map boundary at this point, having played the game for several hours with Luton so far. And although there's some milsim shooters out there like Arma that have overly complicated control schemes and very complex gameplay that can take a while to get into, Squad has taken a different direction and actually simplified the controls. In fact, I can bind all the keys that I need very quickly in this game, and there aren't frankly a lot of buttons that that I need to learn. If you're familiar with traditional shooters, you should have no problem getting in a squad and knowing how to do all of the commands. And much like a game of Battlefield, each team is broken up into multiple squads where you can voice communicate amongst your squad mates and assume various roles. The squad leader can put down an FOB, which allows your teammates to respawn on and continue the assault. You can also pick roles like grenadiers, support gunners, uh, designated marksmen, and they all come with their own custom weapon loadouts and gear. Now, because because this game is pre-alpha, it's literally not even feature complete yet. Currently, it only supports infantry combat, but the final version of the game is going to have tanks, APCs, and even helicopter support that can all be player controlled. The servers are also supposed to hold up to 100 players at any one time, making it essentially a more military realistic version of Battlefield with even more players. The game mode I've been playing is objective based with flags and capture points that you need to move between. It's very similar to Chainlink from Battlefield where you have to capture points in a specific order in order to move on to the next one and uh, either team can capture points and push back against each other. Now I've really been enjoying this game a lot so far and I think the best way to sort of convey what the gameplay is like to you is to just show you some natural gameplay where I'm going to be on comms with Luton. We'll be moving tactically, calling out targets and uh, transitioning between firefights. And if you are interested in the game, you always have the option to pre-purchase and the website even has a little donation link because I think it's a pretty small team of devs, but they're doing a hell of a job so far. This is why we needed that um, base because now that base would be a good overview for us to defend from, you see. So sometimes you've got to like step, you've got to set it up ahead of time. One guy's dead on that hill. That was a good grenade throw. Oh shit. I'm gonna throw that one back, bro. Me. Oh shit, he's right here. Guys, possibly enemy bunker on the south side. I might have just got him with the grenade. Oh, we're not. Definitely didn't get him with the grenade. Looking H98, H98. This is a cool looking that. map. Can I like this. Yeah, this is a different one. I haven't played this one so much. Ooh, dude, these poppy fields are beautiful. Yeah, they're really nice. The valleys are nice as well as you get across to it. I this is a great good one. one uh... I'm just trying to have a little firefight with this guy down the road. He's sticking his head out of a building and I'm trying to get on him. Okay, so in the top right, when it has that little red bar, does that mean we're capping it or something? Or we're fighting over it? Yes, it means we're capping it. But they have currently capped it. I got a guy. Oh, I'm right behind you. Watch it, you're taking fire, man. Oh, yeah. They're, they're trying to clear our... This is the FOB, obviously, and they're trying to clear this out. Because they don't want us to have this, so they can push us back harder. Yeah. What is they're the... Uh, oh, shit. Insurgent right there. Okay, you got him. They're coming in the front door. Yeah, yeah. Keep it locked. We need to check. They've probably got some kind of rally point around here we need to find. Okay. Probably in this compound. The compound just uh, sort of southeast from our base. I think there's somebody still back in that smoke. Oh, yeah, you see this. me? 
Yeah, I'm checking these. Oh, right oh, in you, Lou. I got him, he just came out, yep. Nice. Oh, there's like three to four right here, spread out a bit. They are moving, uh... Oh, looting to our... Below us on the hill. Yeah, okay. I'm I think I got one by left. that smoke. See where the smoke is? That's where Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, we gotta find the entrance. We're looking for like their little, there's, there'll be like a, a bunch of bags together, that's like their little rally. As soon as we, oh, this is actually, this is an enemy FOB. Okay, got one. Yeah, we're taking their FOB. Basically, all you have to do is be in the area of the FOB. You see that yellow bar that's popped up top left? Yeah. That means that we are in their base. So if we can clear enough of them, we'll start destroying it. Got to clear these buildings Shit. and stuff. I got to reload. There's a guy on top of the roof. Check the roof. Yeah, okay. Yeah, we need reinforcements on the front gate. Hus, okay. Hus, get in here, you need a medic. See me? To your right. Holy crap, bro. Is that friendly fire? I hope so. I think I just got this guy through the window. Oh, uh, I'm down. <laughs> They're coming in real hard. Is there a dude's body hanging through the ceiling? <laughs> yeah, yeah, that's the guy I killed on the roof and he's like dangling through me. I shot him in half. We just need to hold this line. We have another squad engaging their flag right now, so we need to hold this hill. I will try and get us an FOB and stuff set up shortly. Okay, got one. Yeah, they're aware of our flank. They're trying to flank where we are right now. Yeah, they will. Yeah, we do have a bit of an advantage on this hill, though, so. Hope that guy's dead. He's much What's harder that shooting. What's little thing on top of the hill? Down. Is that a guy? Oh. Yeah, that is a guy. I got eyes on guys about four to five moving from the uh, south towards us. Oh, I got him off the hill. You see that shot? Good shot? I didn't see it, but good job. He rolled all the way down the hill, dude. That was sweet. I like I like the fact that I like the danger of um, not knowing if you got the guy. You got to go and confirm the kill. It's it's much better. Dude, they're kind of pretty sweet spot. Holy crap, that is a lot of bullets flying that's the, machine, that's the machine gun, yeah I see you. Guys, throw smoke, throw smoke. Alright, smoking. Uh, I think, oh my god, the time it takes to switch between stuff in this game. Yes. Is really cool. How many smokes do I have? Three smokes? Oh, nope, only two. Okay. Moving up. Right, come on, guys. Last. Oh, cool. Come on, guys. Last stand. Let's take this base. Come on. Let's get this one. Shit is crazy, man. Fucking so I'm many just grenades fucking and shit. rush this base in. Oh, shit. I killed two and I got a reload. There's a guy uh, just jumped on my head. Picked an RPG, Luton. Like um, I've got it right now. I see. Okay, but just I'm gonna just, hit that spot. Are you just ready? saying. Yeah, go on. Hit it. Oh shit! That, that was me. You. You never get... Are you alive? <laughs> yeah. Hit the other side of the wall. I keep pressing. We've lost the base. We've lost the base. We've lost the base. We need to get in on it as well, guys. Look, we've lost the base. We need to cap that hard. Getting on the building next to you. Yeah, level. they're ladded up in there. Oh, what? I can't get up on there. Damn. Okay, this building here, I'm pretty sure there's I just, a guy or two in it. I just set a new rally point, guys, on the north side. It's a relatively yeah, safe, safe area. Safe area. Okay, one. Got one down this building. Right. Should probably move near. Yeah, we should probably move out of here so they don't find this dude. So, where I put the rally point, I don't think we should fight from there, guys. We should just, we like, use it as a point and then get out. Oh, shit. Okay. Good kill, good kill. Good kill, friendly oh, around. Shit, Watch I it. need to reload. There's a guy on the roof. He's totally exposed. Yep. North. North? Yep. North of my position. I got one. Okay, I got the guy right in front of me. We've got him pinned in. We've got him pinned in. Get some grenades in that building and uh, just surround it. 
Level. Oh, level. Feels pretty good for the uh, shoe to be on the other foot like yesterday. <laughs> Rooftop again. Okay, I think I got one off the roof. Do we have guys on the roof? Nope, that's them. Okay. I'm basically on the west side right now and I'm just trying to get in this building. I just took one out. I've got eyes on this west side basically. If you can see I, I'm in the uh, grid of F. Six, three. Oh shit, reload! Reload, reload, reload. Fuck. See you, Lynn. Yeah, I'm just covering. There have been a few coming out of here, so I'm just covering this. If you guys want to move in carefully, you can. I've got you covered. Yeah. Okay. Maybe I can get an RP. Oh, there, there. Nice. Okay, I'm moving up on you. I'll keep it locked. Okay, I'm going to reload when you get here. Yep, yeah, sure, sure, sure. Attack Brit is with us as well. Okay, reloading. Yep, got it. Okay. <laughs> Look at that guy with the gun through his neck. Careful, careful, you're taking hits. I got one, he was brown. Okay. Right, guys, just get in here and shoot anything you see and just try and hold this down as much as we can. I said possibly we've neutralized and we're holding. I'm having to do a lot of communication with Ross because he's trying to work out how many people to send and how many to attack with. Fuck, man. Holy oh, crap, there's a lot out here. We've got control back. Ross, we're taking control back right now. It must be in the base. I think I think we need an auto run button. Is there one of this? Level, what would you give right now for a quad, a bike? I know. So I just want to, <laughs> a bulletproof Humvee would be great. <laughs>